today for work um silver everything which is hilarious because i don't wear silver normally so i have on my really old ring if you guys are like og subscribers i wore this every day in high school or not in high school beginning of college i did wear it in high school but i didn't vlog in high school it's silver um the silver ring silver kendra scott my green twill it's kind of wrinkly but whatever green twill back in action dress with these sandals in black that's why i'm wearing silver because they're silver studded like i said this is silver and then silver little hoops from target i think black band um yeah that's what we're wearing and so just a lot of black and silver so i'm going to head to work i'm gonna grab my cup go grab my food and we are going to get to work um i have practice today and pictures and stuff so i'm going to bring you guys along for all of that here's what my dress looks like with the sandals um yeah again kind of wrinkly but i like it my legs are tan because i tan them for pictures already i have to tan the rest of my body um so this is a good dress because it shows off my legs, but literally nothing else because everything else is pale. So that's what we're in today. I totally meant to vlog, but forgot. So I left work at three o'clock because if I didn't already mention when I, I don't even know what I said this morning. <laughs> I was really tired. Um, I have pictures tonight um, in our new uniforms. I will not be able to vlog in the locker room and stuff because these uniforms are not going nobody knows what they look like we just got new ones we get new ones every three years just like the football team so um this year is the on year for both the cheerleaders and the football team to get new uniforms football team obviously has already shown their new uniforms but we have not they're getting debuted at this sunday's game so this vlog is going to be a game week plus i'm getting my pictures today and recruitment um i don't know if you guys are new um I was, so I just graduated in May and I was a Delta Gamma at Northern Kentucky University and I was, my senior year I was vice president membership of recruitment which means I just ran recruitment um, and we had a COVID year so everything was very like Zoom and separated and it was a hard year to run recruitment but it was fine. Well, they always bring back around five alums to the recruit, to the next recruitment and um I got chosen and I'm also I don't know if you guys also watch that vlog um, we also have dream girl for our sorority and it's just somebody who like represents our sorority's values and like all the stuff and the chapter votes and I won that as well and it's always a senior so um, yeah I don't know if they always bring back dream girl but either way um, they usually bring back like the previous recruitment person and that was me plus Dream girls. So anyway, I'm going to recruitment this weekend. Um, it's four days at our school because we only have seven sororities, but I can't be there Thursday because I have practice and I can't be there Sunday because I have a game. So I will, but I will be there all day Friday and Saturday. So I will bring you guys along for my like little recruitment weekend as well and show you guys recruitment outfits and stuff because I didn't really get to do that last year. So, but I've, re I've vlogged recruitment every year since sophomore year I, d I vlogged freshman year but I didn't have a channel yet and I was too embarrassed to post that but that was a great vlog I wish I wouldn't have deleted that but anyway I'm curling my hair right now to get ready for pictures and then I'm going to put on some tanologist and then my makeup my hair is done um obviously it needs to be brushed out and stuff but I'm just going to let it cool and um go ahead and tan my body I am officially ready um I did all of my tan. It's a little like crusty in the like arm creases, but I'm hoping if like it shows up in the camera that they can edit it out because they said um, they're gonna edit out anybody that might have a tattoo, even though we have to cover them up for practice. I think they said they'd rather just edit it out. I don't really know. But I'm just wearing my ripened raspberry cloud um, wash tee with my rhino gray embossed shorts or hottie hots. This is an all yours tee, rainbows. Um, because we have to go in comfy clothes and then packed um, everything for pictures. We don't have our uniforms yet, so we had to wear our bra, which I have on, bring palms and boots. I think that's all we have to have. Um, 
and then practice clothes which is tights gym shoes sports bra and shorts which i have um everything is in this lululemon bag and then this is just like i have curling iron hairspray brush keys all that type of stuff um so these are the two bags i am taking plus my box with my boots in it and then my other drawstring bag with my practice palms i'm assuming we'll need those um i'm not gonna brush out my hair until i get there so that it's like a good whatever i don't know so we're gonna do that when we get there and yeah i am also gonna add mascara when i get there and then just my lipstick i'm gonna fill up my hydro flask have my earrings on we just have to wear rhinestoned studs um so i've always worn these i wore them to every clinic and everything for thing else so yeah this is what i look like going there um and again i'm not gonna be able to get any clips so i will probably just see you guys after and let you know how how i think my picture went i guess but um i'm also um i packed food because i already ate lunch and breakfast but i'm just gonna eat my snack after my picture before practice so that's Guys, the plan. it is wednesday um I decided to treat myself and get some Duncan. Um, I didn't want to do Big B because you know it's my Friday thing, but we're doing Duncan today. I don't know. I didn't have to be at work. Normally, I try to get to work by 8 o'clock so that I can leave by 4 o'clock, but I have a meeting till 5 today. So, no matter what, I can't leave till 5. So, I was like, might as well not get there until um, 9. So that's what I'm doing. I wore this shirt. I actually really like it. It is this like mustard kind of color with um, like ivory cream, like leaf looking pattern. And then it also has navy blue in it. And then these like roughly short sleeves. And then I just have on my navy blue Lululemon pants. And I did wear these like, sorry, I have so many masks. I'll show you guys down below these like espadrilles that I wore I don't know I felt like they kind of went and then I just have on my anthropology bracelet my badge some gold hoops and gold necklace or I don't have any necklaces on because I just feel like whatever my hair is still kind of waved slash curled from pictures and stuff yesterday practice went pretty well um pictures we don't get to see them so I don't know that's a little nerve-wracking because you don't know what your picture is gonna look like and you know other people think you look better than usually you do so it'll be a it'll be a weird thing I think this Duncan drive through might take 30 minutes like I don't know if I should do this it's literally wrapped around the building and it hasn't even moved so this will be interesting but I am at Duncan I promise you we're here so yeah I don't know what this situation is but yeah I have on this ring and then these two rings but yeah and I have my water um so we'll see work is a nine minute drive from here really everybody so I decided to go inside to get my coffee because the line was so long and I was just like you know what I think going inside honestly might be quicker and I definitely think it was but it's just funny because everybody did it after me yum one pair of Lululemon pants I went from stretch high rise to now wonder trains but I still have my shoes on because I'm getting ready to go to cycle bar at work so I can like go right in um, I have to put new clips on my cycle shoes so I'm gonna try to like get in there and have them do that right away so I put my shirt back on because I forgot to pack a shirt but I still match because it's navy blue just left cycle bar and now we are headed to Bath and Body Works to pick up my order and then I'm also headed after that 
to um, Jot, which is one of my favorite um, Indian places for Indian food and um, we're gonna go pick that up. Trevor called and ordered it. He ordered um, food for my two brothers, me and him. My parents are going out to dinner tonight so we just added my brothers in on the um, thing and then, yeah. So, yeah, I'm gonna go to Bath and Body Works. Just literally, I'm about to park. It's across the way from Cycle Bar. And I've ordered, so I've got, since, or during the candle sale, I got my candles for like eight bucks. I got white pumpkin leaves, pumpkin apple, and um, autumn. And then for, they had a wallflower deal, that's what I'm picking up. So I'm getting um, a bunch, I got three wallflowers, and then I got three um, car freshener things. So, very excited. So we're just gonna park really quick. And we are here. Okay, so I just got out of Bath and Body Works. It literally took two seconds, but I wanna show you guys what I grabbed, even though I kinda already told you. So I just grabbed two leaves car fresheners this is my favorite scent uh pumpkin apple and leaves are both my favorite scents but in my car i'm super weird about like sweet scents in my car i think like the smells can be weird so i like outdoor fall scents in my car i don't know and then i also got a pumpkin apple um I don't know if you guys can see that. I have pumpkin apple might be my favorite. I don't know. I have a bunch of the like, I have two vent clips and then I have a um, like one that you put up here. So I'll literally probably have the two and then I don't know. I'll have to figure out what I want to do. Um, but I got three of those. They were on sale for, I think they were three for nine. So $9 for all three of those. And then these were $3 each because they were on sale and then I had 20% off. I already have leaves. I got that with during the candle sale. So I pick, had to pick up, of course, a pumpkin apple. These will liter are literally like in my room at all times and I try to match them to the candle. Um, pumpkin snickerdoodle. Um, I love these. Like I ha always have to get kind of like one um, sweet one, so had to get pumpkin, snickerdoodle, and then autumn. So, I'm up, like Bath and Body Works, I maybe light like cactus blossom or um, mango pineapple or something during the summer. You know, one candle a summer, but, and then I do volcano a lot from anthropology or like Capri Blue, but during the fall, I always have candles going, so. Now I'm gonna go pick up our Indian food and Trevor also got Starbucks and I think he got me a pumpkin cream cold brew. So I'm gonna have that too. Orders, I've had it done in like 10 or 15. Mini? Suck it. Suck it. Suck it. Suck it. How's the flavor coming? I'm on a call right now, that's probably what you guys hear, but I'm about to head to Cycle Bar. This is what I'm wearing. Um, I'm using my lunch for Cycle Bar, a 30 minute ride before practice today. And then I'm going to come home, I have to get gas, drop off a package, pick up a package, come home, shower, and then I'll get on a call and then I'll eat lunch and then practice dances. So that's what we're doing. I just pulled up to Cycle Bar. My call got over at like 11.48, which is good. I was already in the car because I switched to my phone. Um, but I'm gonna go on in. Still can't wear these shoes. I don't know if I got updated you guys. So I had to get new clips because um, mine were like kind of messed up. So I got new clips. Clearly like there's some of my nice black ones. And then this one, they literally cannot get out. They tried and I, they like tried while I was in my class for 45 minutes. So I have to go get like some special tool. So I'm still not able to wear my TMs. So I have to wear their shoes. So I wore Birkenstocks and shoes and um, socks. And then after Cycle Bar, I'm really quickly gonna run and ship this Chopo dress or no, what is this? Oh, 
this is red dress boutique i'm stupid okay ship this red dress boutique dress it has to go to ups um and i'm gonna go to like our to like the newport shopping center because i have to get gas anyway at kroger then i'm gonna ship the ups and then i have to pick up some socks from dicks i did a buy online pickup in store for some socks that everybody says are great to wear with our boots for the game we're wearing boots since we're wearing our uniforms and everything because it's our first game of the season this sunday so those are ready to be picked up and Dix is right next to UPS and Kroger gas. So I'm going to do all of it, but I have to get back and get showered for a um, meeting at 1.30. So we'll see if that works out. I just got out of Cycle Bar. Um, it was a hard ride, even though it was just 30 minutes. I feel like they make them harder, obviously, so that you're like still getting a really good workout in. Um, so now I'm just going to head really quick to go get gas package order. So yeah. And then I practice tonight. Tonight's the last practice before our game. So it's like one of the most, in, like all the practice, I mean all practices are important, but the one that's the most important, it's always the one like the Thursday before the game. So yeah, it always makes me nervous for that practice because it's just like, it's, a, it's hard and it's um, really important. <laughs> Now I'm at Dick's, I don't know if you guys can see that, to get my socks. I got my receipt from UPS and got a full tank of gas. So I'm excited to go home and shower. It's almost one o'clock, it's 12.55. So it's a little bit later. Um, after all of, I don't even know what I did today. Um, after I went, to run those errands um of course i worked until like 4 30 and then i practiced and then i started getting ready or i worked till 4 practiced till 4 30 and then i started getting ready because practice is at 6 30 instead of 7 so it's 5 45 i'm just gonna put on my red lip and then head on into practice um i have my boots practice palms my bag water all that stuff um I'm so pale. I've never gone to practice this pale, but I'm self tanning tonight and I have to pack a bunch of stuff for recruitment tomorrow because I'm going straight after work. So I'll probably catch up with you guys after practice. Red lip is on. Never vlog after practice. It is 9 12. We got out at 9 instead of 9 30. Practice started at 6 30. I'm just in this garage chilling. But I'm going to go home. My mom made pasta and broccoli, so I'm going to go eat that. But tomorrow is Big V morning, so we're going to do that. I have to pack everything for recruitment and stuff. I think I've said that. Self-tan. All the things. I'm using fake bake tonight, but that's what's going on. I'll show you guys my recruitment outfit tomorrow. Um, Trevor and I are getting sushi. Yay! And I'm going to curl my hair tomorrow morning, so I have to wake up extra early. Up this morning. I like... This is a lot earlier than I normally wake up for... Um, work especially on Friday but um, I just went into the bathroom and like went to the bathroom washed my face brushed my teeth and then I blow dried my, the back of my hair I don't know if you guys are the same way but my hair doesn't dry when I like go to bed with it wet um so I'm gonna go ahead and curl my hair and then um yeah, so I just turned on my curling iron, so I'm gonna wait for that to finish heating up. Um, and that's pretty much it. I have all my jewelry laid out. Um, I was gonna show you guys something and I don't even remember. Oh, I finally used, I got this um, when I got my blowout in June. Finally used it. Um, just, I use the, I don't know if, you, if I've ever told you guys this. This is the best detangler. It smells good, it has heat protectant. Um, it's for color treated hair. I freaking love it. I use it every time I take a shower. And then I have the Pureology, same brand, um, weightless volumizing mousse for color treated hair. And I don't know, when I got a blowout, they used it and I really liked it. So I bought it. Um, it kind of helps keep your hair or keep curl. And so I just put it in my hair wet last night. And then um, I'm curling my hair and it needs to stay. Obviously, I'm going to touch it up, but I'm going to keep it curled for um, 
tonight, which is recruitment, tomorrow, which is recruitment, and I'm doing stuff tomorrow, and then um, the game Sunday. So I'll show you guys like the final product. So I'm about to leave. I'm just wearing this sweater, like tank top with little white tassels, really dark jeans. Can't decide between the darker like espadrilles or these ones that I'm wearing for recruitment. Um, my hair is done. All my jewelry is on, but I'm going to brush out my hair. So, I don't know. Here's your reminder. Get. Get. It's supposed to be get mask. Either way. Oh, and I have my little Kate Spade watch band. Alexa, stop. I also, I linked this bracelet in my last vlog, and I'll try to link it again. Um, so, my anthropology. So. You too. All right. Time for a big B day. So, I'm back. That kind of took a while. The past two weeks, sorry, I just smell my hair. Like, literally, it's so, um, like, ugh, so breakfasty in there. Ugh, ugh. I can't smell like bacon and eggs. That's disgusting. Okay, anyway, but um, my hair's still up in a clip, so I'm gonna brush my hair out. I got my coffee. Weird because it's great, but there's literally no way that there's an extra shot of espresso in here. And I asked for it this time. I also got a side of ice because, like, they don't put ice in it. So, now we're going to head to work. Hopefully, I can get out kind of early. I wanted to get to work by 8. It's 8.41, so that wasn't happening. I woke up at 7, but it's because I had to curl my hair and get everything going. My skin smells like bacon. Yeah, I have an issue. Okay, so we're going to go to work I still feel like I don't know an exit to take when I get um out of here so of course gotta make sure of that so I will talk to you guys after um I might vlog in like the bathroom or something when I'm getting ready the bathroom at the end of the hall to start getting ready during my lunch and then I'll go finish my lunch at my desk and actually eat but I meant to tell you guys this is from J. Crew. I don't know if I said that and then my dark wash jeans are from Madewell and I'm wearing my Ugg wedges 19 minutes later guys 19 minutes and I'm done we are wearing masks at recruitment, so I did my normal makeup. My normal makeup, but like less contour than normal since we're wearing masks, but good to go. Okay, leaving work and heading to, I can't even think, school. KU. So, not really my school, but the school I graduated from. 20 minutes. Okay, we got it. Let's go. I'm here. We're in this building, I think. So, this is like crazy being back on campus. Like, I don't know. Whatever. It's just kind of crazy feeling. But, I think all I need is my purse. I have deodorant and perfume in here. Um, they're gonna give me a shirt. I already have everything else on. I have my brush in here and I'm gonna grab my water and I literally think that that is it. So here we go. What a f weird time. Like I feel like I'm literally back in college and I was seeing a bunch of um, other sorority girls that like I'm I follow and stuff that go to school here post pictures and I'm like oh my god like I just miss recruitment and like college so so much it's crazy but I'm hoping that I don't have to climb up that many stairs because I'm going in right there we will see I literally have a vlog up on that top like porch from my junior year okay walking out of recruitment um like i said they just finished the last round um we don't have to stay like we literally can't because we're not in the chapter anymore um 
So yeah, seemed successful. There were only four rounds today because they split it up. Here's what the shirts look like. They're super cute. They're um, like tan. And then I just have an alumna um, badge, but tan with white, um, super cute. And then Sam, who is VP membership, she was one of my directors last year and then now has the position I had. She ordered these masks, look how cute. So everybody matches, they're just like the disposable ones, but they're like a pearly pink. And it looked so good with the outfit, so. I love it. I'm going, and then I told Sam because I feel bad that I'm not there Sunday, and like the alums are supposed to kind of be there like to get you anything you need type thing, and so since I won't be there Sunday, I was like, let me get your coffee. So I'm gonna pick up a bunch of coffees tomorrow for them. Um, I don't know if I'm getting just hers, if I'm getting the other recruitment team, because they're, they have to like cut down the list a lot tonight. So they're gonna be up pretty darn late. So I was like, let me know your coffee order. I told her I could do Dunkin' or Starbucks. I'm thinking we're just gonna do Starbucks now because I wanna be able to like mobile order and not order 600 drinks. Okay, I just got home from sushi. The lighting is so bad. But look how, I'm in my kitchen, clearly. But look how cute these sweatshirts are that I just got from Shein. Well, shirts, sweatshirts. So I got the, these for work to wear with like little skirts, kind of like casual, cute, whatever. So I got this heathered green one that says Hello Pumpkin. I got all of these. I think these were like $6. I'll link them because these come in like a bunch of different colors, but um, I got a small. And then I got, I don't know, I thought they were so cute. Like I have, I have like a bunch of like little, um, like I have these like, or burnt orange pants that would be cute. I have a tan skirt. Um, yeah, I think the burnt orange would be cute with this. So this is just like a creamy color and it just says, hello fall. How cute, size small. And then this one I got for Halloween, um, to wear around Halloween, I don't know. Trevor and I might be in like Colorado for Halloween this year. Um, if not, I'll probably wear it to the office because we are gonna like wear things like that the Friday before Halloween. Um, and then like maybe to pass out candy or something, but I don't think we're gonna be in town on Halloween. So I'm gonna wear it in Colorado on Halloween, but it's this light blue sweatshirt and it says boo on it. And it's so cute. Look how cute. And it's like, I got like a Christmas sweatshirt from, if you guys remember my vlog from last year for Christmas, I got a Christmas sweatshirt from Shein and it was literally like a thin gray shirt. It was barely a sweatshirt. This is like thick and it's really soft and fleecy inside. So I'm really impressed. I got this in a medium and it fits really good. So either way, like on the airplane or something, this with um, black, um, leggings and my golden goose sneakers would be so so cute so I'm excited but those are the little things I got from Shein thought I'd show you guys um, because hopefully I can like link them and you guys if you want them can get them um, before the fall is over because it hasn't even started really so I don't know I just feel like they're so cute and these type of shirts on boot at boutiques and things are like way more expensive so yeah, and there's a bunch more. Once you click on one, a bunch more show up. So I'll try to link like some that I think are really cute because there's one with a pumpkin that is adorable. Also, I can't be at bid day, which is sad because we have a game, but like, I'm not sad I'm missing it for the game because I want to be at the game, but I'm sad that I have to miss it, if that makes sense. Because um, I want to be missing it for the game because it means I'm dancing at the game. But, I still got a bid day shirt because that's just how it works, but look how cute it is. So bid day theme is um, 
like pastel rainbow colors so i think it's so cute um every year i've been in the chapter our theme just happens to be our theme happens to be something that the colors are black white and red so i'm excited to see delta gamma in other colors than black white and red um last year our theme was super cute but it didn't happen because of covid so but yeah i freaking love this i think it's adorable like any like pastel little I, I feel like there's gonna be a lot of like pastel like shorts and like um, tennis skirts, but it's gonna be so cute. So yeah um, The shirts were from South by the Sea if anybody is wondering I'm all ready to go. I still have to brush out my hair and stuff um, But I just have on some gold bracelets Apple watch. Here's the dress. It's from Shein um, that Pink Lily sells it. Obviously it's more expensive on Pink Lily, but it's a little better quality. I wore it in pink to a wedding. I'll insert the picture here. Um, but the theme is light blue. I bought this for um, a really nice anniversary dinner and Trevor and I never got to go on it. Um, and then I, when I found out that recruitment for this year was light blue theme for this day, I just never wore it and saved it. And then I have on my Tory Burch sandals, but I'm going to wear my Sam Edelman block heels. Um, I'll show you guys those. But um, just for now, like walking in and out of the building. What is this crazy loon doing? So, yeah. And I have on a gloss right now, but obviously like we're going to be wearing masks. And um, I just have to put on my gold Madewell hoops. All right, we are at Starbucks. I don't know if you guys can see that. So here we go. I have been to Starbucks when it's been crazy, but I don't think I've ever been when it's been that crazy. I think there were close to 40 people in there, and then I just feel bad for, like, the workers because they can't help that, like, a million people are ordering and stuff, and then so, like, they're getting yelled at stuff I don't know I'm just like I'm not really in a rush at the because like I don't really have to be there at a specific time like I'm an alum but I feel bad because I have like these people's coffees that have been up since like 3 a.m. so but we got the coffee mine are back there or there's a back there mine's here I got straws and we're gonna go hey guys I am back recruitment is over for me not for them um, so they are all done and they're all going on their lunch break and then they have like a bunch of stuff to do um, I am going home it's three o'clock I just mobile ordered Chipotle so um, my pickup time was I did 310 because I didn't feel like the quickest like I wouldn't and it's 258 so I'll probably get there around 310 so I'm gonna go pick up some Chipotle and go home and eat it I'm going to like chill for a second um, I need to finish this Pedialyte. I haven't really, like, drank any. I need to charge my camera. It's flashing. Drink some more water, some Pedialyte. Eat my Chipotle. I want to, like, chill while I'm doing that. And then I need to pack and practice before I go out to dinner with my friends tonight because I don't... The worst is, like, feeling, like, stressed and not having everything together because when I come back home tonight, I want to be able to kind of, like, get ready for bed and go to bed because I have to wake up at, like, 5 a.m. So... Yeah, I got so many compliments on this dress, which is hilarious because it's literally a Shein dress. So, I definitely need to, like, find a time to wear it again because I do really like it. Um, and all the weddings I'm going to, I literally have dresses picked out for. So, maybe another time, but it's super cute. So, um, I'm going to go get my Chipotle and then we're going to go home, take off this makeup and stuff. I'd rather just redo my makeup and I'm going to charge my camera. So, I'll see you guys um, when I'm getting ready for tonight, probably. All right. Here's my bowl. I get brown rice, pinto beans, extra fajita veggies, corn, lettuce, and guac. Um, so I get a veggie bowl. Really good. And then I'm going to put that on there. I didn't get any chips or anything. I literally had this um, the day before game day, two weeks ago. Um, water. And then I have this just like little cup of ice that I'm going to pour my Pedialyte in. A lot of people are asking what um, Pedialyte is for. Um, so I don't know if you guys can see this. So it says like intense exercise, heat exhaustion, all that type of stuff. It's like electrolytes and it just really like gives me, I don't know, I feel like it helps. I was like 
you're dancing non-stop for four hours in like 110 degree heat and I didn't start feeling terrible until the last two minutes of the fourth quarter um, so yesterday I had um, 16 ounces of Pedialyte and today I'm doing 32 and then tomorrow I'm doing 16 but it's still just as important to drink water so I try to do a gallon of water a day so yeah the strawberry one's super good way better than pink than the fruit punch so I haven't been like struggling to drink it I just have been at recruitment all day and haven't really had time so now I'm just gonna like chill eat my food and like practice and pack and stuff and then I'm getting dinner with my friends Peisha and Beth and then their boyfriends tonight so totally forgot we had these so I'm definitely eating these um, with my bowl they're so good you guys need to get them if you have grower near you so good so I just went ahead I think I told you guys um, that I was gonna take off my makeup so I did I just like redid it um, I feel a lot better because like I was wearing a mask the whole time which is great we should be wearing masks for recruitment because if one person gets COVID everybody literally every sorority girl and PNM is screwed but like my it was off my nose and then it was like kind of just gross so I just went ahead and redid my makeup um Trevor came here obviously because we're going together and um he got me a little tall apple crisp macchiato with soy milk which I need to keep chugging my water I'm watching the Charlie or it's like the D'Amelio show or whatever um, I was just watching Rachel. I forgot that this came out and I was watching Rachel Radke's vlog and she was like, if you haven't seen it, check it out. So, yeah, I'm going to get changed and decide if I want to wear what I have picked out. My hair still looks pretty good from earlier, which is really shocking. It is, see what the temperature is outside? 82. Tomorrow is 90. Why? It's been literally in the 70s all week and then the day of a game, 90 degrees. Look at this. Sunday 90 and sunny are you kidding me are you kidding me not even a chance of clouds okay anyway um and then for lips really quick like um I've just been really liking just I've been putting it on today sorry I need to drink more water throwing on this gloss um I don't even remember which one I have on. I think I have this one on. This one is Creme Brulee from NYX. I love their butter glosses. I used to wear them all the time. Reason I just don't wear them that much is because I'm not like, I don't like sticky gloss, but Creme Brulee and Fortune Cookie are some of my favorites. So here's Fortune Cookie. And then I have another one. Um, as you can see, this is more pinky and this is more nude. And then I have one that's more like of a berry color. Um, I think I talked about it either earlier in this vlog or last vlog and then I've just been like packing stuff for the game tomorrow um, And that dress this is like a pink dress. I'm gonna wear to the game tomorrow So I'm just been kind of like going through that. I'm actually gonna go grab stuff out of the dryer for the game um, I have shorts tights and two practice bras in there. So I'm gonna go grab that before I put on my clothes um, I'm thinking this top with these jean shorts, but we'll see I threw on this little sweater thing from Princess Polly. It has like this. That's what we're wearing. I just put on... Where the heck is it? Here it is. This Kylie lip kit in Candy K. It's very matte, but... I feel like it's a good color. It's perfect. Is it now? Yeah. It's perfect for the night. <laughs> I didn't wear that short sleeve shirt because it showed my bra. I need to just wear it with sticky boobs one night, but I was not really in the mood to wear sticky boobs. And this will be good because if it's chilly in the restaurant, and it's supposed to get out of like 65 tonight. And Trevor thinks I'll be cold no matter what for some reason. It doesn't matter. Yeah, uh-uh. You're always cold. No, I'm always hot usually. <laughs> not if it's like below but, 70. Yeah, this is just... They had it in a few other colors on Princess Polly. It was in my first Princess Polly haul when I was worked with them. And I think my 20% off code is still working, so use that. Okay, okay. Trevor and I, this went to Kroger to, um, my voice literally sounds like a man, but to get um, foot inserts for my, or I guess shoe inserts, they don't go in your foot, shoe inserts 
for my boots tomorrow. We're wearing our new uniforms, like I said, and um, probably in this vlog. And so all the vets are saying like get inserts because the boots are literally like, they're so uncomfortable to dance in type thing. And then I got, well, I got my favorite wipes. They have them in like the travel section. They're my favorite to wipe my sweat after cycle bar if I'm going somewhere. I'm not going home right away. And then I got a sweatshirt dress. Oh it's a burgundy sweatshirt dress. It's really cute. I'm excited. I'll show it. But it's originally $36. I got it for $20. That's pretty good. It was on sale. And they had black, gray, blue, olive green, burgundy, and I don't know what else. That might have been it. But yeah, maybe. that's like in the blue. It was like a lighter blue. But um, I got the burgundy because I ordered a burgundy dress from Red Dress Boutique and ended up returning it because it was not cute. Um, and I have too many green dresses. I even have a Lululemon long sleeve green dress. So, oh my gosh, what's going on here? I could wear this with sneakers. I could also wear it to work. I'm excited about it. But I'll try it on. And then, um, I don't know, we wanted something sweet, of course. We'll meet. So, Golden Oreo Thins. And then, I kind of wanted a little snacky snail. For the double stuff for batteries. So, I gave the double stuff. For um, the locker room. Like, I eat, like, granola bars and stuff. But, there they are. Oh. Um, I got these little cauliflower crackers and they're in everything um flavor so i'm excited i don't know i suppose that my parents went to a watermelon party we don't know um i am just gonna go ahead and get oh, a coffee going this morning um i look like a ghost because all i have on is powder and eyeshadow well like foundation powder I have to do like contour blush. Sorry, my voice sounds like this. <coughs> I kind of lost it. So I don't really know. But I'm going to go ahead and make a latte. Um, yeah. So I'm just using this Starbucks. I'm only making one shot. weird our power went out like while I was doing my makeup my room light turned off which is like super weird um crap I don't even think we have milk I have to go downstairs to check but we do okay we had one downstairs so good to go on that I'm gonna measure out a third a cup like always Power went out like weird. So, because the only thing that was working was my mirror light, but it was for like 10 seconds. Not even. So, I don't really know. But it is like literally the microwave time is gone, but it's 6 22, and I need to leave at 7 o'clock. I've been up since five, so I'm gonna put this coffee together really quick. It's supposed to be 90 today, which means like 100 on the field. So don't ask me why I decided to curl my hair, but I wanted to for pictures, and then <laughs> and then it'll fall. It's really okay, but it's in a clip. But I'm gonna put some ice in my latte and go finish getting ready. All right, I got out of the house. Um, sorry that it's not focusing. Um, pretty good on time. It is, I don't know why it's not focusing, sorry guys. Okay, there we go. It is 7.06 and I left at 7.05. Um, I'm still on my street, but like nobody's out. It's super early. I mean, for a Sunday. But, yeah, that's it. But I'm just going to go. Obviously, finished my makeup. Um, 
my hair is already falling, but the mornings are always humid, and then I, like, I don't think the humidity is supposed to be super high today, so that's good. Um, when I get there, I'm gonna put my lipstick on. We, I think we have to put it on before we walk in. Like, I don't know if that's a rule or not, but I'm gonna do that when I pull into the garage. I um, have my parking pass in my Apple wallet. And, um, yeah, this is our first real season game. Last one was preseason. I know a ton of people going to this game. Um, obvious, it's, you know, hundred like, thousands of people. It's not, like, like, there's gonna be at least one person there that I know every time, but you know what I mean? So, um, like, closer people to me are going, which I'm really excited about. And, I don't know, I have, I think I have all my stuff. Hopefully, like, if I were to forget something, I would have enough time to go home and come back. Or, hopefully get a hold of somebody in my family, I don't know. But I'm, we're crossing my fingers that it doesn't happen. I have a Pedialyte chill in there. I did like the mix one in 60 ounces of water. And then I have my water bottle. I have an extra water bottle, which is not really like a thing. You don't really need like all those extra water bottles like I do for practice. Cause here we have like a cooler with like Gatorades and waters and we have food and stuff. Like we're treated really well. So, um, <clears throat> that's it um my hair is still up in a clip because it just helps the top kind of stay curled for a little bit um even though i know i'm going to be recurling it after our practice because we practice on the field and then you pretty much get re-ready but i ended up wearing it's like this high neck kind of flowy pink top with just nude sam edelman heels the ones i wore for recruitment yesterday and i will catch up with you guys like in the locker room or something <laughs> okay hi team I know you guys are watching this because you're obsessed with Corinne, you watch all of her stuff. But I wanted to say hi and that I love you and I'm thinking of you. Hey, it's Today Hannah back at it again. I'm giving the uh, JV dance team Highland a shout out. We got our new unit! <laughs> new unis. <laughs> I'll show them closer up. We got the Bengals little logo there. Bengals logo on the NFL one. And the Bengals. Where's your booth at? <laughs> yeah, the Tiger's eyes on the side. Mm -hmm. So cute. <laughs> 